Well, today marks one year since a series of tornadoes ripped through North Texas. This is a look at newly released video showing the moment that one of those tornadoes hit Central Market in Northwest Dallas. The outbreak caused an estimated $2 billion in damage from Dallas to Garland, shredding homes and neighborhoods, businesses, and dozens of trees. Taking a live look from Central Expressway and North Haven Road in Dallas, where homes and a Home Depot store were all destroyed. But in a message of hope, that location, that Home Depot, has since reopened. Now, many other Dallas businesses destroyed by last year's tornado have rebuilt. But this morning, investigative reporter Brian New looks at why that's not been the case at one of the city's busiest intersections. Here in northwest Dallas, at the corner of Marsh and Walnut Hill, last October's tornado destroyed the 73,000 square foot Marsh Lane shopping plaza. A year later, nothing out here has been rebuilt. In fact, the city of Dallas sued the property owner last month just to get him to clean up the site. The property owner says he's working to get the property back up as soon as possible, but would not elaborate further. Meanwhile, neighbors out here say they're frustrated by the lack of activity. And the lack of communication. Yeah, I mean, the city was quickly recovering, and we felt like this intersection felt a bit stalled. Just driving by and it going on for so long uh, was just, again, very heartbreaking. But these same neighbors say they see a potential silver lining in all this. We'll tell you what that is and how that could galvanize this community coming up in our special report tonight at six. In Northwest Dallas, Brian New, CBS 11 News.